Hello friends, I'm Maria, aka Cita from Cita's Budgeting Journey, and I'm so happy you're here. If you're returning, thank you. And if you are new, please hit that subscribe button and notification bell, and a huge welcome or welcome back to all. In today's video, I will be updating my no spend, low spend for the month of May, and I will also be doing my $2 Thursdays. Now I'm going to be stuffing my mini savings challenges, and we're going to do two challenges that actually belong to a collab so give me one second let's move this out the way and let's get into our planner just to see where i am with my spending guys i am so close to meeting my goal but for whatever reason this girl just keeps spending <laughs> and spending i don't know what's going on but that's okay let's see the last time I updated was Monday the 20th, and that, guys, was a spend day. I hope you guys can see. Let me just move this over a little. There we go. So the 20th was a spend day. The 21st was supposed to be a no spend day because I had no plans on going anywhere. And I did really, really good until late afternoon. Once the kids were done with school, I was like, come on, kiddos, let's go. And we went to the movies. We went to see the new movie that just came out last week. It's called If. The kids loved it. Actually, I liked it. It was a cute movie. So that ended up being a spend day. We went to the movie tavern and you can actually get, you know, order actual food instead of just concession food like popcorn, candy, soda. So we were able to order our meals. They bring it to your seat. So I ended up spending money for the tickets. And then I also bought dinner. But the good thing is that I didn't have to come home and cook so that was a plus wednesday i was supposed to get a massage yesterday i ended up rescheduling it guys i had to pick up my son's death certificate now i know you guys are like wait the video you just posted you said he passed away in 2019 i could not bring myself to get that death certificate it almost was like like that was it that piece of paper actually seeing it with his name all his information was like this is it you know, he he's really gone. So that was really, really hard. I went, picked it up, didn't look at it, made sure I sealed it, stuck it in the in my bag, and it's still in my bag. So I need to send it out, but we'll take care of that another day. So we did that. After I left there, I had to take my truck to the dealership because every time I took it to get serviced at a at a tire shop because it kept saying, you know, low pressure. They kept thinking or saying it was my front, let me see, my front driver's side tire. Ended up being my rear passenger side. It had a nail, not even a nail, a huge screw in it. So they ended up plugging it and I ended up getting my tires rotated. So I ended up using money. But you know what, guys? I just remembered. I'm going to take that money out of my car envelope and put it back into my account because what I did was I used my, my debit card. So I am going to put that money. See, this is why it's good that we budget and, and that we you know do the recap for the week because I completely forgot that I have money in that envelope and that's one of my sinking funds so that was taken care of after we did that I had to go shopping at Sam's Club I still had money for that I think I went over like eight dollars but I also ordered the kids love to get their pizza hot dog I had a slice of pizza too uh, so we spent a few extra dollars while we were there so needless to say this was also a spend day Now for today, it's still early in the day. I am not leaving this house. So I know for sure that today will be a no spend day. So let me get my little sticker here. And guys, this sticker here means that I only have one more day in order to meet my goal of 15 no spend days for the month. So we've got this, we've got this. I can stay home at least one more day within this next week and a half period. Now, this week is going to be rough because I have doctor's appointment, doctor's appointment, school, science fair, and another doctor's appointment. So, yeah, it's going to be rough, but I think I, I think I've got this. Okay, so on to our mini savings challenges. Y'all already know this makes me happy. It's, number one, it's fun to do. And number two, I love to see the money grow and it definitely helps us save for either our sinking funds pay off debt month ahead whatever you're going to allocate the funds for so i have 50 dollars here before i start 
with the mini challenges i want to do this here this one here is soft light budgeting and budget with carly they had a collaboration trying to reach their 1000 thankfully both of them have met their goal but don't forget make sure you drop by their channels and you know watch a couple videos because they're always in need of watch time it doesn't end when we reach a thousand subscribers guys so what i'm gonna do is just roll once for each and then Whatever's left over, we're going to use for our $2 Thursdays. All right, so we'll start with this one. So that's $5. One, two, three, four, five. I got a five on this last time. So we now have $10. And that's fine because this money here is either going, well, this one's going to my 100 envelope challenge. And as I stated before, that's not my Disney challenge. This is actually going to go towards my personal 100 envelope challenge. I'm in no rush to get that one done, but I like to, you know, see it grow. So that's where that money's going. All right. This one here is also from their collaboration. And let's see. Okay. We got a six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Isn't that funny? That's exactly what I got the last time. Six on this one and five on the other one. So instead of leaving us with $40, guys, this will now leave us with $39. Mm, that's okay. So let me take these six out. So how are you guys doing? How's the weather where you're at? It is so, oh my goodness, it's so humid here. But we had thunderstorms. They actually woke me up at 4 something this morning. And it was pouring, pouring down rain. It was horrible. But it's actually supposed to, we just got an alert that it was going to rain again. So I don't think it's going to rain. Hopefully not as bad as it did last night or early this morning. But it's so humid. The kids are like, it's hot. And I'm like, mm -mm, we're not turning that air on yet. <laughs> not yet not the central air so but it's not that bad it's just humid because it don't it's in the 70s so the temperature isn't really that bad it's just the humidity after the rain Alrighty, so are you guys ready let's hope everybody gets a little bit of love we're almost done with this one here so hopefully number one two three four will get some love and we can finalize that one because that goes to our lawn care <laughs> guys do you do y'all see that it's a four. What are the chances? One. Two. Okay. Six. Guys, I like this. I like when they all get some love. Six. Three. Okay, now we need a five. Two. Two. Come on, Bruno needs some love here, guys. Let's get a five. Nope. A three. A six. A five. We got a five, y'all. A one. A one. Oh boy. A six. Okay. A five. A four. A five. We got three dollars left. And a two. Well, we might as well find a home for this one. A six. All righty. Not bad at all. So let's put these back so we can put them back in order. And we are going to start with number one. What did I do with the binder? The binder is right here. 
All right, so this one here, I believe this is for family, if I'm not mistaken. Yep. And we are just going to cross out, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, not bad, eight. So let's cross out the four and the four. So that's eight. We should now have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Fourteen out of thirty, not bad. Next was number two, and this one is going for birthdays. And this one has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight dollars. So that would be two, four, six, eight. So we should have 16 now. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. It's one thing I like about doing this randomizer challenge when you randomly, you know, you don't have to, it takes a guesswork out of how much money you're putting in each one. And some of these get stuffed pretty fast. All right, this one I believe is self care. Yes, it is, and that's one, two, four dollars for self care. And we've got one, two. How much did I say, guys? Uh oh, I think I did too many. I sure did. One, two, three, four, five, six. So now I'm going to owe $2, but no, I'm not because I'm going to find me $2, guys. Give me one second. So now we should have 8, 10, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. See, that's my problem. I like to talk and I like to talk a lot and then I lose track. All right, let's focus, Maria. Let's focus. One, two, three, four. Wow, we only need one more here in order to finish this one. And this one is for lawn care. All right, so we have 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. And this one is for $24, so it'll get done. Next time we do our mini challenges, we know for sure that we'll have at least one completed challenge. All right, and Silencio Bruno. I thought Bruno wasn't gonna get any money today. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six. Six dollars, Maria. That means you're gonna cross out three. One, two, three. And Bruno has 10, 11, 12, and six, 18 dollars. And this one is for $30. Lastly, we have this one, which I believe is for vacation. Let's see. Yep, vacation and vacation. Got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's right. This one got the extra, the extra dollar. So we're going to do two, four, six, eight and we'll just color half of this one here so i know that it needs an extra dollar so we should have 19 dollars here five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen dollars and that's it now guys all of this money except for the two that were for the collaboration will be going into my sinking funds so a few of these, as you saw, are close to being done. So once I'm done with that, we'll be adding that money over to our sinking funds. And then these two here, I did say that one was going into my 100 envelope challenge. And the other one will be going into, this is 100 envelope challenge. And this one is going into my one month ahead. Alrighty, guys, I think that is it for today. I know it's a pretty quick video or maybe not because it looks like it's 16 minutes long. <laughs> um, but... 
it you know i didn't have a whole lot i just wanted to do this here because again if i keep this money i'm just going to spend it so i want to start stuffing my mini savings challenges i have so many beautiful ones that i want to complete so as soon as i'm done with one i'm just going to replace it i am going to stick to just six challenges at a time but again once i'm completed one i'll replace it with another challenge Alrighty guys, you guys have a wonderful day. Stay blessed, be safe, and we will be chatting soon.